Welcome to another episode of Truck and Tuesday by Race Grooves. Thanks for tuning in. Here we have another one of the truck and transporters models. Comes with Dog Fighter. I do believe this color is exclusive to this package. Here's what the features of the truck truck is. You can the features of the truck are not is. Here you have the images. It looks like the cab detaches, and of course. Dogfighter can be driven separately. You have a uh, rear hatch or ramp in the back. This info bubble here says flip down cab. I don't, I don't see anything to where it would flip down on the cab, and they don't even show it there. I wonder if they're talking about the, if they got the, the wrong package. I'm not sure because uh, you know what, this one right here, this one, I know that this one, the cab opens up. I think it flips forward. You wouldn't call that, what they call it? A flip down cab. Mm, I don't think you'd call that a flip down cab. But I was looking at this one right here. I wonder if this one is hinged right at that point and then this flips over and down. I'm not sure. Uh, there was uh, five other trucks at this time. These were probably released in 2007, but the copyright on the package is 2006. The yellow truck comes with Axelium or Axelium. The green one comes with Enforcer. Remember, the decorations on the models are exclusive to this year's truck and transporters packages. The black truck came with Fast Fuse. Here's the package we're doing today with Dogfighter. This truck's kind of uh, swoopy, and well, that's why it comes with Ooze Coupe. It kind of has that long swooping design. Ooze Coupe, nice model. And lastly, the black and green one comes with See You Later. Some of these models haven't gotten a new color in a long time. Do you have any color samples of any of these cars? This truck has a lot of shiny chrome. Has chrome smokestacks. Has a chrome gas tank. Chrome exhaust. It's a shiny wheels. Look at it reflecting on my turntable. Hot Wheels logo. Let's check out this. Easy opening. Oh, nice and long. That means our, our vehicles are going to come out pretty nicely. Not like, well, they'll get st stuck a little bit. There's Dog Fighter with his propeller. Drive back in. Let's take a look at the grill. Fenders, or the bumper, is chrome. This part is not chrome. Well, actually, the grill, the grill is shiny chrome, but the outside is just silver paint. No interior, they have silver painted windows. Let's go ahead, it showed it came apart. Let's check it out. Careful, careful. Hey, I found an easier way. Just give it a little twist, pop right out. There's a, well, not much of a fifth wheel, but that's where it goes. Here's a look at the base. Copyright on the base, 2001 Mattel. So that means there's probably other colors of this truck. Wouldn't, uh, I didn't go through all my collection to see if I had other color samples. Must be 2001 copyright Mattel. Check out the bed. Has the diamond plating right here. This is interesting that it's open right here, kind of. I don't know if that's supposed to be the parts underneath the truck. Let's see if we can get light in there. Nothing uh, up there in the, in the cavity. Hmm, I wonder... Uh, pretty long. I wonder if two trucks. Well, let's let's see. Remember I said it had like a, a flip down cab, right? Yeah, I think uh, that information was on the wrong package. Wasn't supposed to be on the package with this truck. Let's see uh, something I just thought of. Pretty long. Let's check the squeaky. I'll be quiet. Well, that's kind of noisy. I'll do it on the carpet. <laughs> But I don't hear squeaking. Rolls, let's see. This one rolls nice. Pretty good. Now this part here. This looks pretty long. I wonder if we can get two Hot Wheels models. Let's get Dogfighter. Drive them in. Oh, you're a plane? Okay, hold on. There you go. And let's see. Who else should we get? Uh, who else would be a good car to put in there? Let's see. GT Hunter. Mm. Kind of long. I don't know. Let's see. Uh, well, you're going to have to find shorter models if you want to squeeze two in there. GT Hunter's too long. How about we check this right here? I forgot what this one called. Mm, I don't want to say without. 
73 BMW, 73 BMW, 3.0 CSL race car. That's the name of this model here. Yep, yeah, not enough of room for him either. Well, I found another volunteer, somebody who's definitely going to fit. Gravedigger! Let's give him a little lift, push him in. There you go, he fits. It's time for the squeaky wheels test, along with the turning radius. That was fantastic. No squeaky wheels and fantastic turning radius and it's pretty cool that you get an exclusively decorated hot wheels model with this release nowadays i'm recording this in 2018 they just use a recolor of a car that's been issued before uh, and put that back in there but that's all right you know that's the way it goes keep costs down sometimes it's just nicer to pick up these other samples so you get exclusive models thank you for watching and have fun with your toys bye bye